Welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to talk about prime factorization. That's a fancy word for just finding the smallest prime numbers that multiply in this example to 72. So let me go ahead and do this in fast motion. 2 times 36, and that's 6 times 6, and that's 2 times 3, and 2 times 3, so it's 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 3, or 2 cubed times 3 squared. Okay, there is my answer. Now, let's take it in slow-mo, slow it down, and talk about the steps. Let's come over and look at the rules. Okay, the first thing you want to do is just write down your number. And then you're going to start with branches. So you're going to draw two branches from each composite number. Now, a composite number is a number who's, that factors into something other than 1 in itself. So there is another number that divides into that number. You don't want to draw branches off of any prime numbers because once you hit a prime number, that branch stops. Then once you're done, you're going to make a list of all of the factors from the least to the greatest. So you want to start with your smallest ones. So let's go back and look at our example. Okay, here's our example, 72, and I'm actually going to factor this a different way than I did the first time to show you you can do this multiple ways. Okay, I'm going to start with 72. And 72 is, is a composite number, so I draw two branches off of 72. I have an 8 times 9. Okay, notice that's different than the last example, and that's fine. It doesn't matter how you factor it. Now, both 8 and 9 are composite. They both have other factors. So both of them are going to have two branches drawn. Now, 8 factors into 2 times 4. 9 factors into 3 times 3. Now, on this step, I'm going to stop because I have a prime factor here at 2. 3 is also a prime factor, and 3 is a prime factor. The only number that is composite is 4. I can draw two more branches off it and come down and write 2 times 2. So now I have all my branches drawn. I've underlined where my branches stop, and I can now do a summary or a list at the bottom. I have 1, 2, 3 twos. So you can write that as either 2 times 2 times 2 or 2 cubed. And then I have two threes, so that's three times three, or three squared. And there is your prime factorization for 72. Hope this helps.